Okay, now we're gonna show off what all the different decks play like. So we're gonna do monsters. Then we're gonna do uh, Northern Realms. Then we'll do Scoia'tael and then Skellige. And then we'll finish off with Nilfgaard. This is just gonna be one game with each deck. This video will probably just cover monsters. Not all and battles need end in bloodshed. Monst yeah, we'll Bloody just do each faction words. in one video. Okay. Well, I obviously need to push that out. Uh, okay. So I'm going to start off by playing Azura's Double Cross. Uh, you might notice that Azura's Double Cross adds 9 points. This will control my opponent a little bit. Enough. Let us finish. Okay. One of the benefits of this deck is that you can always get rid of the um there is no Oh. Can I not hit the target? Unfriendly? I can't. Wow, I thought wow. they changed this. Yeah, they changed this. I can no longer target no un yeah, so now I lose both of these. That's a new change. I did not know that. Sorry, guys. Okay. We don't want him locking us, so we're not going to make it a, a threat so much yet. My men know the meaning of sacrifice. Do they now? Hmm. Your humble servant. Okay. We're going to copy one of my wild hunt guys. Chosen one. It'll give me some more wild stuff to throw at him. Normally I would have preferred to have the Mithral in my hand to copy, but you can't always get what you want. Your humble servant. That's a lot of buffing. Death comes for you. So, my opponent is definitely losing out over time. Chances are he'll be able to destroy these spies, but they're not really giving him that much value. I'm expecting him to have something to keep this on to the next round. But he's playing against Resistance monster. Is so he's gonna hit me, which is fine. I get more value from mine, my guys. We wanted him to play this before we played that uh, Cathanthier. Burak. Interesting. There is no escape. Uh. A grotto dum anime est space. Est. Oh, he's gonna get a buff from killing one of my guys. I'm going to put that there. I, he can't really hit me with the Dimeridium bomb. The stars reflected in a pond for the so night he's going to kill his uh, guy. Nothing will stop us. You uh, know, burn all that out. Yeah. 
I can actually pull the medic out of his graveyard, which is interesting. We're gonna play the commander's horn. I think that's safe, pretty much. Ah, he's gonna die Meridian bomb me, which is kind of expected. Big fight. Utter your wish, and I shall make it so. I had another option. I warned you. Okay, we're gonna pass now. We're gonna assume he can't get um, six points with his last card. The good of magic oh, is the greatest good. Uh... <laughs> okay. He barely wins. But again, eh. Eh. A great doom anime is space is. Nice Ted up to. That's an interesting choice. You crossed the wrong sorceress. A shame I have no time. Oh, I can't revive medics. Interesting. We're gonna get the combat engine. I warned you. We're gonna put it on that, and we can pass. And that's what makes. I was wanting to revive the medic, but I'm not allowed to, apparently. But he gave me a pretty good card. Oh, I'm kind of confused. So some aspects of the monster passive befuddle me. Maybe I should have waited until I knew he didn't have Geralt Igni. Alright, I win. So, there goes the um, Mithral deck. Operator didn't shine all that much in it. But, you can see the general gist of what I was trying to do. Okay, now we're going to do... Let's do a... Let's, let's play some Consume. Let's play some Consume. Consume is fun. Again, these are all my first attempts. Some of this is just my first attempts with these decks that I've come up with. My men know the meaning of Am sacrifice. I getting the same person again? Naivety is a fool's blessing. Well, then I better make sure I get Caretaker. Yeah. Monster doesn't have all that many creative gold cards. So I got all that. I got that. I need, I need some Necker Warriors. So let's drop these. Ow. <laughs> this will be funny. Yeah. You just yield now. Hail Kerzer! Oh, 
your humble servant. Oh, I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. I'm so freaking dumb. My men know the meaning of sacrifice. Ah, man. There is no escape. Yep. Now it was all planned. None of that was a mistake. Appearances can be deceived. I shall be your eyes, my lord. Not all battles need end in bloodshed. Interesting. He doesn't really have much things Hail to do. Interesting choices he's making. I'm gonna eat that. That's actually an weird move for him to make. Naivety is a fool's blessing. The Nordling's hatred for us. He's a lot of, um... It's interesting that he did that. He's not... He's Like, I'm gonna get a bunch of cards out of the next round, so... I'm not terribly bothered by the fact that he had that card. Oh. That's weird. Hey. Right. So... I'm gonna add You talked enough. There will be rain or frost, perhaps. Okay. I'm going to use his own thing against him. The combat engineer. Barbarians. To bring more power into the next round. Okay. 
and I'll get two Neckers out of it as well. I'll have three things on my melee row. He can't Arrowman see me again. So, I end up with having a lot of stuff on my next round. Ooh, Gonter Odin. I'm gonna, uh... Probably start off with Gonter Odin. It might sound, seem weird. My world. But it gives me my more rules. stuff on my melee row. Don't make me laugh. Always willing, pal. And I win again. Though there there were some mistakes in that. We're gonna pretend like they didn't happen. <laughs> uh let's mm, Tragic Stars is really cheesy. You guys have seen this kind of stuff already. Yeah, so you can get rid of the lockedness with decoy. As I did there. Men of Kedwin! Like, Attack! I don't know if yeah, do I have a diamond ring bomb in this deck? I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, I do. I just don't have it in my hand right now. Boom. Don't need it. There's my Dimeridium Bomb. I'm going to need Dimeridium Bomb to win this. Uh, Ragnarok. Uh, Aromancy. Ragnarok will be very helpful. Um, can I get more buffs, though? Because I don't think i got any more than just Aromancy, will I? I do want to have multiple weathers. Blizzard Potion will probably be safe. Yeah, this will be fine. Okay, so I'm going to just do Clear Weather, Dagon. Not a bad idea. But we're broke as shit peddlers. Oh, that's unfortunate. The weird thing is, even if the Ancient Foglet gets um, hit with a blizzard you potion... Crossed the wrong sorceress. Okay. I really hate uh, Yennefer, but she doesn't really hurt me. Okay, they're gonna play another one of these guys. Hopefully I don't get Scorched, but if he Scorches me, he loses Priscilla. We're gonna use a uh, Swallow Potion next. He's definitely wanting to play Priscilla multiple times. Yeah. We're gonna play our Swallow Potion now. This will make them uneven. Yennefer is completely countered by my weather. Yeah. So now I'm protected from Scorch. I don't have to worry about it. Well, actually, I was protected from Scorch because of uh, Priscilla. I should have thought about that. Yeah. But I'm not protected from Geralt Igni anymore. Yeah, that's what I, that was another thing I was thinking about. To note that I shouldn't probably have put the uh, resilience on that card, but I think I hold the second to last card I had. So, yeah. So if I put um, Adrenaline Rush on one of these. Okay, so the first thing's first. We're going to play Ragnarok. This will make his turn a little harder. Then we're going to play Avalok. Then we'll play Adrenaline Rush, and then we'll pass. Damn it. Yeah, well, there goes our strategy. He got them all evened up because of Yennefer. It's time. So we lost this, for the most part. 
We don't have a way to get back from this. It's not very, very often that you run into a, both a Scorch and a Geralt Igni these days. So, he got, he got, and the Yennefer made them even. If they were uneven, I would have been safe. But, can't always be lucky. So those are my three uh, monster decks.